Hey guys, it's Marie, and welcome back to my channel. I'm doing something a little bit new here. I really hope that you guys like it. I don't know about you, but I love ghost videos. I love reacting to ghosts. I like watching ghost or <laughs> reaction videos to um, ghost videos. So I am going to start my own reaction video. Uh, videos here on my channel. So amongst other things, um, I really wanted to do this because I find myself watching videos all the time and reaction videos all the time. So I was like, well, well, shoot, I should go ahead and just make my own, right? Um, I had to turn on the light back here because the video that I, I have up for us to watch tonight, um, the sound of the sound already got me and I was like, <gasps> I can't sit here in the dark and do this, which I was, I've been working on trying to get this whole system working and, uh, I was sitting in the dark and I was like, Oh, fine. But then I turned this one on and I was like, Oh, there's something about the music and the sound effects that just got me. And I was like, Nope, we're going to turn on the light. Um, a little bit of a light at least. So, uh, I want to eventually just to let you know that those are wind chimes right here <laughs> so if you see something shiny in the back that's what that is um i want to eventually do live streams of reaction you know do reaction videos and talk with you guys and whatnot and just have fun with that um but yeah so i do i hope that you guys were able to see my paranormal investigation video out I didn't, it wasn't like a huge investigation but it was back out of the missoula cemetery so i have that posted on my channel i hope that you guys got to see it um if not please make sure go check it out also um if you want to see more of these videos if you want to see more spooky stuff um i promise you guys i'm going to get more spooky stuff on this channel i'm working on uh, learning the different systems and um, I really want to grow this channel as well because you know TikTok um, may not be here for very much longer we'll see and I really want to grow this channel so uh, if you guys are coming here from TikTok please make sure um, say uh, just comment below comment a ghost emoji or something um, but yeah but anyways um, I love you guys. Uh, let's get started here. My heart is already racing. So, woo. Okay, here we go. It is the scariest video I've ever seen. And already, you can tell, like, I paused it because the way the girl was reacting to it. Oh, my God. Okay. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Oh, my heart is already pounding. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. I might have to turn my volume down. Okay. Eric, oh. from the Project Ghost YouTube channel, ventured into a local cemetery where his attention was drawn to a particular mausoleum. Recognizing its potential for his latest endeavor, he resolved to embark on a daring challenge, remaining within its confines at the eerie hour of 3 a.m., mm. seeking communication with the supernatural realm. You can only say that you are here, so I can continue talking to you. Y'all, I, I know I do this. I have that same, I have that same spirit box. I have that same K2 meter. I don't have that, the other spirit, the round spirit box, but he is at this place. He's at this mausoleum at 3 a.m., you guys, and he has to stay in this mausoleum by himself for the entire hour. He's already tripping. Look at camera two. Like, what? There may be some jump scares here. I don't know. But here we go. There's a wall behind me. I can't tell from the echo. Who the fuck is What the hell? Nope. The doors are locked. Oh my god. 
Okay. That's okay. That's okay. Thank you for communicating with me. Always be polite. Always be polite, you guys, when you go on investigations. Okay. Calm down. Calm down. It's okay. It's okay. Nothing's wrong. As Eric endeavors to establish contact with the spirits, an unforeseen event unfolds. The once open entrance door abruptly slams shut. Perplexed by this inexplicable like, occurrence, that could be the wind. Eric meticulously that could be recounts the moments slipped, leading right? up to the event. All right, guys, so I've been sitting here, standing, nothing's happening. I've been quiet. I'm panicking. This is too much for me. I will be back. <laughs> I just, I just, it's too much. It's too much for me right now to handle. And like, as panic grips Eric, his terror intensifies rendering him paralyzed by fear. Paralyzed. With trembling resolve, he resolves to abandon the cemetery, only to be confronted by a harrowing sight. The a sinister apparition that? materializes behind the wall, sending shivers down his spine. Nope. Overwhelmed by the chilling encounter, <gasps> Eric brings his haunting challenge to an abrupt halt. Grappling like, is that with could have been a person question. as well, you know what I'm saying? Like, that Did could have he been capture a genuine paranormal activity? Or was it all an elaborate fabrication? The ultimate verdict rests with the viewer. For those seeking the complete investigation, visit Project Ghost's YouTube as a group of friends embarks on a leisurely drive through the late-night streets of France. Their intent is to savor the serenity of the hour. Like right here? However, their journey takes an unexpected turn when they encounter a sight that defies all expectations. What begins as seemingly mundane footage quickly transforms into a captivating display of the extraordinary. Extra. Join them in witnessing the startling event that unfolds oh. before their eyes. Yeah, alors, super saxo chrono. Super saxo chrono. Oh, le trottoir. <laughs> ça, ça marche. Ça, c'est de la puissance. Et on va, on va faire. Why are people filming like that? It doesn't make any sense. Like, hey, man, what's that? What's that? Oh, fuck it! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Y'all, his scream made it worse. His scream made it worse. Hands down. His scream made it worse. But this is the white lady. Look. That's the white lady. That's the infamous white lady, you guys. This could very much be edited. But yeah, I think I've I think I've covered the story. Not like this. So the white lady is everywhere. Um, she's all over. I mean, she's a bride who lost her groom, was stood up basically at the altar. Um, and there's different stories when it comes to that. Um, but she is said to um, have lost her groom at the altar and um you know unalived herself and then since is left to wander uh taking revenge on guys so uh, i think the thing is is if you keep going that's where danger ensues if you see it turn around you should be okay but uh i don't see a head do you guys see a head? This scream. Oh, but that's true. It's someone. Yeah, they're gonna turn around. But that's true. It's someone. Wow. What? No. Hey, but it's like a ghost. They keep going. They keep going. Where's this the same? They're in the village. Yeah, they're there. See, they keep going. Yeah, they're in the path. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. In the deed of night, as they traverse the desolate road, a spectral figure in white materializes before their eyes, oh, igniting no, primal fear no. and prompting no, panicked no, 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 reactions. No, 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 no. Moved by compassion or perhaps <gasps> driven by curiosity, they resolve to investigate further, only to find the apparition vanished without a trace upon their return. Look in your back seat, Was boys. it the ethereal presence of a departed soul? tethered to that eerie stretch of road, or a that skillful ruse orchestrated to unsettle the weary travelers. 
Despite fervent speculation and diligent inquiry, the mystery remains steadfastly unsolved, shrouded in the unfathomable depths of the unknown. Such inexplicable occurrences serve as poignant reminders of the inexorable uncertainty that pervades our existence, reminding us that even amidst the mundane, the most unsettling truths can unveil themselves when least anticipated. Paranormal investigators, Victor, Paolo, and Samuel, renowned for their work on the YouTube channel Investigação Sobrenatural, are summoned by a distressed woman. She recounts a harrowing tale of relentless haunting following her brother's tragic demise from an accidental overdose in their family home in Brazil. Convinced that her brother's tormented spirit remains tethered to the earthly realm, she asserts that his wrathful presence is responsible for the escalating disturbances plaguing her and her family. Tragically, she attributes her mother's recent passing to the stress induced by the relentless paranormal activity. As the investigators arrive on the scene, they are swiftly drawn into a maelstrom of violence and terror. Olha, o, pelo que eu entendi, né, seu irmão tá fazendo manifestação aqui, o clima tá muito pesado. Não precisa chorar, fica calmo, fica tranquilo, tá bom? Deixa eu ver. Tá bem não, tá? Olha, vai ficar tudo bem. É, você falou que o seu irmão morreu aqui nessa casa, né? tiraram a vida dele dentro de um banheiro. Tem como me mostrar onde foi esse banheiro? Só aqui no banheiro ali. Esse aqui, né? Já começou. Por favor, meu Deus, 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 meu Something was tied to them, like a string or something, attached to the bowls, the plates, the whatever just fell, to cause it whenever they moved to fall off. So, just saying, before we assume, <laughs> but that was like her reaction was legit. Ó, oh, ele só quer assustar, entendeu? Só quer te, te deixar desequilibrado, entendeu? Quer fazer com que a gente fique assustado, entendeu? Nervoso, respira like, fundo, fica calmo, entendeu? Pense em Deus, pense em coisas boas, tá bom? Tá bom, respira fundo. A gente tá aqui contigo. Isso, calma. Viu? Ele só quer tentar assustar a gente. É só um, um, mais um desequilibrado, só isso, tá certo? Você tem condições de continuar? É... Porque é importante. Tem, não tem? Pronto. É, me mostra como foi que o seu irmão faleceu. Calma, calma. Calma, calma. Não, Calma, fica calma. Respira, entendeu? Mas quando ele caminha. O espelho quebrou sozinho. Meu Deus. Vai, filma aí. Toma espelho, toma espelho, toma espelho, toma espelho. Toma espelho, toma espelho. É isso, gente. Meu Deus. Ei, Vitamina. Esse não, pega uma cadeira aí. Ela tá vendo? Ela tá vendo? Respira, respira, respira. Ó, vai ficar tudo bem, tá? Mas qual é que tu pegar uma cadeira? Pensa em coisas boas, coisas positivas, né? Foca em Deus, olha, olha, olha pra mim, olha pra mim, olha pra mim, né? Pensa em coisas boas, tá bom? Foca em Deus. Vai, senta aqui. Vem. Vem. Senta. Ó. Oh. Olha, olha pra mim. Calma, calma, respira. Respira. 
As the investigators gather around the table where the deceased man's body had been temporarily laid to rest before his burial, they embark on a solemn attempt to pacify the enraged spirit. Illuminating the dim space with flickering candles, they engage in earnest discussion, seeking to understand and address the unsettling events unfolding around them. However, as they delve deeper into the paranormal phenomenon, the atmosphere grows increasingly charged with eerie intensity, and the boundaries between the living and the dead blur further. Aí é pra, pra vocês verem, né? Ó, direto, ó, acontece. Ele Pega ajuda aqui, não. Pega, calma, calma, calma. Respira, segura, 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 segura. As tension mounts within the room, the door suddenly slams open, jolting the team with a surge of adrenaline. The cameraman, overcome by a crippling panic attack, collapses to the floor in distress. Hastily rallying to his aid, the investigators offer support and solace. Recognizing the need for a momentary reprieve to restore calm to the frazzled atmosphere. After a necessary interval, they bravely resume their investigation, determined to confront the aggressive spirit head on. In a bold attempt to establish a connection and foster communication, investigator Paolo volunteers to lay himself bare on the table, Good hoping to bridge the divide between the <laughs> earthly realm and the restless spirit world. Aí, tu tem certeza que quer fazer isso? Quero, quero ver, né? Tô curioso porque eu quero, né? Eu quero que ele consiga é, entender é, qual é o nosso objetivo, né? Porque a gente está aqui, entendeu? Porque na, na mente dele, ele acha que a gente está provocando, né? Ele está se pensando a gente. Entendeu? É até uma oportunidade, né? De ele baixar a vibração e tentar a comunicação, né? Ou, pelo menos uma comunicação mais amigável, né? As Paulo shares his intentions, a ghostly apparition seemingly materializes behind team member Victor. Undeterred, Paolo lies down on the table, only for the ensuing events to unfold in a truly terrifying manner. If you want to se materialize in front of Paulo, you can se, se present here, né? concentrate your energy, if you want to take it on the arm of Paulo, on the arm of him, on the arm of Paulo, go Paulo. Fica à vontade, se concentra, tenta pegar no pescoço do Paulo. Meu Deus do céu, olha, 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 meu Deus, piada. Você não vai assustar a gente, entendeu? Deus é poderoso, Deus é maior que você, você não é maior que Deus. Okay, so that's crazy. The only way I can explain that one is if there's like a hole in the wall behind and there's somebody back there doing that to the, to the shelves. That's the only, because a string can't, the, there could be somebody behind there going boop, 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 right? Let's keep going. É maior que Deus, Deus é muito maior que você. Você não vai assustar a gente. Você não vai assustar a gente. Ele tá querendo desafiar. Acho que ele pensa que a gente quer bater de frente com ele. Gente, Tô me tremendo so todinho, cara. Olha isso, ó. Filma isso, câmera. Tô me tremendo todinho, Olha isso, o susto que As the investigation progresses, doors from a cabinet begin to slam open and closed with alarming intensity. Unnerving even the most seasoned ghost investigators, the escalating paranormal activity leaves them shaken and uncertain of their next steps. Ultimately, they make the difficult decision to vacate the property, unable to confront the overwhelming force that seems to inhabit the family home in Brazil. Speculation that runs rampant so as to the nature of the haunting. Is it truly the spirit of the deceased brother consumed by rage and lashing out from beyond the grave? Or could there be darker forces at play lurking in the shadows of the house? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Alex of the Hunting the Unknown channel 
embarks on a solitary investigation at an old derelict restaurant, prompted by a friend's chilling account of their own encounter at the site. Armed with tales of spectral phenomena, from objects in motion to elusive shadow figures, Alex ventures forth to uncover the truth behind the eerie whispers that echo through the abandoned establishment. Got a feeling you're being watched by something, but okay. really hot. I know it's, it's 27 now. It's too hot, guys. I'm hoping you're enjoying this sort of video. So remember to show some love and subscribe and give this video a like. So if you like this more, we can we can do more of these videos. Not a problem. I do like doing these ones alone. They are very dangerous and scary. Absolutely, what he said. If you like in this video and you haven't already. Give that like button a smash. <laughs> I really do want to do more videos like these, so make sure if you like it, hit that notification bell, hit subscribe, and yeah, give this a like. Comment below. Comment below. Yeah, okay, let's go. Is there anything can happen while you're, while you're on your own? It's a restaurant? Set up at the moment. Yes. Do a walk <laughs> yes. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> it dunk? Ding, ding. At the onset of his investigation, <laughs> Alex is greeted by a oh. startling occurrence. The sound of a door slamming shut, <laughs> captured by a static camera he had strategically placed beforehand. Dunk. Little does he know. This is merely the prelude to a night fraught with escalating terror. Fraught. I like it. Where are you? Can you give me a sign, please? What the f 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 was that? So I think about the memes, you know? How? Where they ask, like, to... <laughs> to show themselves, the and then they do, and then they run away. It's so In funny. his pursuit of communication like, with the otherworldly inhabitants too. of the building, Alex experiences a chilling manifestation. <laughs> Excuse me. An unseen force topples the bottles positioned directly before him. The sudden and unexplained movement sends a jolt of fear coursing through him, surpassing even the earlier encounter with the slamming door. Yet, the night's horrors are far from over. Steve, are you here? I think you're lying. I don't think your name's Steve. I don't understand how these were locked down. It's crazy, I don't understand this. I'm pretty sure this is like that. Hello? Did you see that? Did you see it? Who's there? Right, 
Moments oh. later, while persisting in his attempt to establish contact, Alex inadvertently captures a disconcerting sight. A dark silhouette, ominously motionless, lurking within Please. one of the rooms. A chilling realization dawns upon him as he contemplates the possibility of an intruder. However, upon revisiting the scene, the room stands vacant, devoid of any presence. Bewildered and unnerved, Alex grapples with the unsettling question, who or what was the mysterious figure captured on camera? Did he indeed capture the elusive activity of a poltergeist or a genuine spirit? The answer, whether real or contrived, remains shrouded in the enigmatic veil of the unknown. Gengaku Drive Inn, an abandoned restaurant nestled in the desolate wilderness, has become a focal point for paranormal investigations in Japan. Ooh. Numerous ghost hunting teams have ventured into its eerie depths, encountering inexplicable phenomena that, that defy rational like explanation. Don't make it out of. Among them is the LOL Creators team, who, like their predecessors, found themselves immersed in the unsettling mysteries of the location. Mm. Determined to unravel its secrets, ghost hunters also embarked on a visit to this foreboding site. In their quest for answers, the crew split up and explore specific areas individually, confronting the unknown in solitude. これ during their investigation, a sudden, unexplained bang rattles one of the investigators to the core, prompting them to abandon their solo exploration and regroup with their team. Unbeknownst to them, as they navigate the shadowy corridors together, their static camera diligently records their every move, capturing the tension and uncertainty that permeate the air. As the footage from the static camera is scrutinized, subtle details begin to emerge requiring careful examination to discern any anomalies. With meticulous scrutiny, the image gradually reveals a figure seemingly materializing from behind the walls and disappearing into one of the rooms. Yet, despite the tantalizing appearance of the figure, doubts linger. Could this be a genuine manifestation of the paranormal or merely a trick of the mind? Where our predisposition to seek patterns and shapeless leads, us to perceive something that isn't truly there. A woman was recording herself oh, while dancing, one. and suddenly she noticed something lurking her upstairs behind her. 
and immediately she ran away in fear. So who or what it could be? A ghost, demon, or just a hoax? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Y'all. That's it right there. That's what had me scared from the get-go. Mm. Oh my god. <laughs> How are you guys? Well, I hope that you enjoy that. Oh, my heart is pounding. That scene had my heart pounding, you guys. And like my like my finger, like my hands shaking like oh. Cool. Okay. Well, thank you guys so much for tuning in with me today to watch the scariest videos that I've ever seen. Part one, oh, it's a compilation of, this is number 56. So I'm trying to find ones that maybe um, us ghost lovers haven't seen before. But of course, there's going to be some that get in that we've seen anyway. Um, but I hope you guys are having a great night. Remember to stay safe, make good choices, and stay spooky. Bye.